Hello friends, you are with me Anuradha from learningmilestone.com and with this tutorial I will be starting a very interesting series on Python where you will be learning Python concepts along with total graphics. So that will make it very interesting when you will see your output on the screen, output in the manner of shapes and patterns on the screen and along with that you will learn Python concepts. So what is Python Turtle actually? We all know what is Python, right? Python is a very easy to start programming language and it is very diverse in nature. And we'll be learning more about it as we deep dive into our programs. But what is Python Turtle? Python Turtle is a library, uh, is a Python library. And with the help of which we can draw interesting shapes and colorful patterns and if we can make shapes and patterns we can make anything right we can make a landscape we can make a traffic light we can make anything right and it also works on uh, we can make game also uh, now how does python turtle actually work so when you will see a screen it will be actually divided into a 2d plane xy plane and mr turtle can move on our instruction to in any direction forward right left or at an angle and it carries a pen it has a position it can we can define the position of turtle on the basis of xy coordinate and we it carries mr turtle carries pen uh, which can be given any color which we want and then we can instruct per turtle um, in our python language to draw the shapes or any beautiful pattern for that matter so let's wait no more and head to REPL editor okay so if you have your editor of your choice that's perfectly fine you can use idle you can use PyCharm or whatever suits you I'll be teaching on REPL REPL is a very popular online editor and it is very easy to start you just have to create login through Google and you'll be get set ready to go and the advantage of using REPL is, is, is your code is readily shareable with the output okay so you can showcase your things wherever you are in school college anywhere okay so let's go to REPL so I am inside REPL editor and what I'll be doing I'll be clicking on this plus button to create new REPL REPL is a place where we can create our scripts and we can choose our preferable language. So definitely we need to use Python. And uh, you see, this creates very funny name. If you don't give it any name, this will be the name of your script. And let's name it as first total program. Okay. And uh, let's click on create. As you can see, by default, REPL is public and even can view and fork this REPL. Fork is that they can make their own copy. Now I'll be creating this. So as you enter into the REPL, you will see different parts, okay, different partitions. This first part is the name of the script. Let it be, don't change it. It's main.py. This is your REPL name. This is your script name and let it be. And then there is this run button and then there is this console part where you'll be um, finding the outputs and this area you will be writing programs so right now we are here to write our first python turtle program right and we know that python has extension python program has extension.py and uh, to use turtle library or to use any library in python import keyword and since we want to import turtle we will write import turtle and first thing which we want to create is turtle screen now what is turtle screen turtle screen is the xy plane remember which we talked where turtle can move on our instruction so let me give it any name so i'm storing turtle screen in this variable name called wn and I'll name it as, I'll create total screen with the help of total dot screen. 
mind it that s is capital and in circular brackets so we don't need to go deep into this right now just remember this is the way to create turtle screen so as you run this program now You will see in your right side that there is this turtle screen created with the title Python Turtle Graphics and uh, we can set background color of this title uh, this screen as per our wish but right now in our first turtle program let's just create turtle okay so you can give it turtle Mr. Turtle any name of your choice and um, for creating turtle we again have to use turtle library which we have imported and then we will use capital T turtle so we are creating screen object and turtle object so don't go into object thing right now so screen object and turtle object which will help us to this is anyways creating a screen and this is creating let's see Oh, this creates an arrow. I was thinking that it will create some turtle and it is just a plain arrow. All right. So that's not the matter. This is a default shape of the turtle and we can give it different shapes like circle. And of course, we can give turtle also. Uh, should we try? Let's see. Alex dot shape and in shape, let me pass turtle. Okay. Oh, wow. We have Mr. Turtle. And that doesn't mean that if I pass lion, I'll get lion out of it. There are restricted shapes, triangle and circle and turtle, which we can have. And uh, so the whole point is because its name is turtle, we can have turtle shape. The default shape is arrow otherwise. So let's just comment this out. So this is the way to comment out in Python. So this code will not run anymore. And our Python turtle will get its default arrow. Okay. And as I said, we can move this turtle on the basis of our instruction. It can move forward. It can move backward. It can move. Um, it can move right. It can move left. Okay. Just imagine this as a person who can move on our instructions. Okay. So, so that is Mr. Turtle. And in our next lecture, what we'll be doing will be moving total around and then we will be creating one square on the basis of our instruction. We'll see that. Okay. So let's go to next program.